Here's a late afternoon update on the winter storm and winter weather that has been impacting the area today, February 2nd. What's going to happen the rest of the evening, the snow that's moved through earlier today is going to kind of taper off and continue to slowly move northward. The blowing snow will continue in some of the open areas, but there is a chance for some additional light snow as we move through the evening hours. A current look at our warning advisories uh, pretty much has the same blizzard and winter storm warnings from parts of northern Iowa, southern Minnesota into the northern two-thirds of Wisconsin. But the one change is some areas of northeast Iowa and far southern Wisconsin have been downgraded to winter weather advisories. So again, the highlights of this briefing, some lingering snow closer to Interstate 94 as we go into the evening. Blowing and drifting will continue in some of the open, flatter terrain, and a second round of light snow is expected later this evening. The snow so far, the main axis runs from Kansas and Nebraska through the Iowa-Minnesota region into Wisconsin here with generally 3 to 7 inches around our region. The radar track shows this, the, uh, the remaining bands of light snow closer to Interstate 94 in the Twin Cities and extending down into central Wisconsin late this afternoon with very little in the way of additional snow falling over parts of Iowa. But some of this light snow back to the west will continue to uh, move back in as this storm exits the region overnight. So an additional 1 to 2 inches uh, in most areas is possible. Uh, temperatures are actually warm enough where some of this could uh, fall as a wintry mix, causing a, a slight chance for some glazing ice, uh, parts of northeast Iowa and into central Wisconsin as we work through the evening. Again, in some of the areas, especially in parts of southern Minnesota and northern Iowa this evening where winds will remain up, there could be some blowing and drifting snow. Uh, some light ice accumulations, again, expected from parts of northeast Iowa into central Wisconsin, although the risk of this looks relatively small at this point. So kind of looking ahead at what radar might show through the evening hours, again, this band of snow as it has lifted north will continue to weaken as we go through the evening, even more so at midnight, but then you see some additional development across parts of Iowa, southeast Minnesota, and southern Wisconsin during the overnight hours and then it moves on through to southern Wisconsin and exits the area tomorrow. So our expected risks here include a little bit of additional snow, minor to moderate impacts, a chance of some glazing ice, and blowing and drifting snow, again, mainly in open areas west of the Mississippi River. So again, summarizing, some winter storm warnings and winter weather advisories continue for uh, at least tonight. We urge you to take extra caution if you do have any travel needs. Otherwise, it might be best just to stay off the roadways and let the repairs and cleanup of snow conditions uh, continue through the day on Wednesday. For additional information, please continue to check our webpage, and we also have posts on Facebook and Twitter through the evening.